Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I created this eye look using my Instabay eyeshadow palette from Catrice. I have done a previous look, so this is the second look. I wanted to play with it again. Um, it's very inspired by the Kim K graphic eyeliner look that she did with her honey palette um, not the same but inspired by so if you guys would like to see how I did this eyeshadow look then just keep watching it is so cold out and my oldest son is home from high school doing online work so I don't have to go get him so I am just doing videos today this is my third one today and it is just helping me <laughs> pass the time while we are stuck inside. So I wanted to do another eye look with the Instabay palette. Um, I was playing around. I was using this brush from my Naked uh, Honey palette and just having this flat square brush was giving me so much precision and working really well with the darker colors, especially with my deep set eyes. I want to place things more precisely. I'm not fluffing it in and out of the crease. I want to place it precisely and then blend it through. So let's do that. Let's just do a matte neutral look um, and play around with makeup. All right, so first I'm going to go in with the darkest shade dupe and this square brush and I'm going to start using this to make my crease and I'm almost going in the crease but I'm just staying above it so you can see it if I went down in the crease it would just get lost so I want to just drag that along and just follow the natural shape of my eye. I'm not going to try to wing it out. I'm just going for like a 90s vibe and it was more of like the graphic lines and this color works really well and blends really nicely for that. So I took the shade dupe and I just really followed along my natural uh, crease line and just it really is making the shape of my lid pop and it's also I just kind of put in like a little bit of extra where my eyes were uneven like this eye just has a little bit more um, like this one's got a nicer shape smoother and this eye in here just the creasing in here and just the shape in here is not as precise so that is just allowing me to keep them a little bit more symmetrical now I'm going to go in with facetune and the other side of the brush from the urban decay palette this brush is awesome and I'm just going to blend that up onto the crease and up onto the crease up onto the top of my uh, eye and just blend it through with dupe. Now I'm going to take a flat brush and repost and just put that all on my lid and just follow along the dark line and we're just kind of doing like a cut crease without using concealer
right just using the flat brush and the lighter shadow just to give my eye more structure just really helps with the deep set eyes and giving them like a nice even look and not just getting all muddy and uneven and whatever the things we don't like about applying eyeshadow with our deep set eyes so now I'm going to take this white eyeliner from L'Oreal and I'm just going to go from my lash line and just draw a slight wing and then we can take our flat brush and just buff it out a little bit just so it's not an, a like a really harsh line and now I'm gonna take face tune and just a rounded brush and I'm gonna go underneath my eye and I'm gonna follow the bottom of the white eyeliner Now I'm going to take a little bit of dupe and an angled brush and just push that into the lash line a little bit. And I think that this look is probably going to get duplicated and be put out here out before I put this video out because I'm always behind on my videos just because it has a similar vibe to the look that Kim K did with the release of her I think she called it honey palette too so it's got that similar kind of vibe so just know that I'm doing this when it actually came out and not a month later so this is my own kind of take on it I think once I started popping on the white eyeliner I knew I, where I was going with this look most of the times I kind of just start with placement and then just kind of get a feel for what I'm doing and just go with it I don't really have like a set eyeshadow look I knew that I didn't want to do anything too dark in the corners I just wanted to keep my lid really bright and just add a little bit of graphic lines here and there it's very 90s um but yeah kim did a very like a similar kind of look to this so i know that this look is gonna be out before i put this video out i'm just taking dupe and just going in the inner corner of my eye just a little bit just to add that like fox eye look too. It's all different looks are getting added in, added in here. All right, so I added a little bit of eyeliner. I tight lined. I added the slightest little bit of wing liner just right on the edges of the white eyeliner. Now I'm just going to go in um, with the shade Insta, and I'm just going to take a little bit on my finger. Not too much, and I'm just going to pat it in the center of my eye. I want to keep it more of a matte look, but I just want to add a little bit of shimmer and glitter just for dimension, just a hint of it. So this is the final eye look. I just went in with some mascara on the outer edges of my eye. I didn't bring in any mascara there just to add to that drawn out look. I think this is such a fun look 
it worked out really well well for my eye shade for deep set eyes so if you have deep set eyes please try this out and let me know how it works for you so yes love this little palette i hope you guys enjoyed the video get the hair off my face and i will see you guys again soon